Sooners need to make some room in the trophy case. They've got another Heisman to display. But what of the trophy with the crystal football on top? From the Dodge Sports Desk, I'm Jenny Carlson, and this is OU Football with John Helsley. John is sitting in today for Jake Trotter because he's still in New York with Heisman duties, and the Heisman seems like a good place to start, John. Sam Bradford, the fifth Heisman winner in OU football history. You were with his high school football coach, Bob Wilson, on Saturday night. What was that scene like? You know, it was a lot of fun. It really was. Uh, it was administrators, people from the school had gathered for a Christmas party, and they basically just turned it into a, a Heisman watch party. And everybody there, obviously, uh, excited for Sam. Uh, Bob Wilson was really nervous, you know, which you wouldn't think of with a, with a football coach who's been in a lot of big games. But he sat there fidgeting. And when the announcement finally came, he kind of jumped out of his chair and, you know, <laughs> kind of made a little bit of a jump around the room. And uh, it was pretty cool being there. Sam's the fifth winner from OU. Where does he rank among those guys? And maybe a little more broadly, where does he rank all time amongst all the Sooner greats? Well, you know, Ranking him among the five is a little tricky right now. Obviously, he's done everything you can possibly ask a quarterback to do, a leader to do so far. If he would go ahead and finish this season off with a, with a national championship, I think it really boosts him right up there to the top. Um, and if he comes back for another year, I think he's got a, a chance to be one of the all-time greats. And I mean, I mean, obviously, you're talking about a lot of great players in OU's history. I think he's got a chance to be right up there in the top two or three. I think some Sooner fans may be a little worried about this Heisman jinx thing. Some guys that have won it recently have gone to national championship games and not won. Is there reason to believe that Sam Bradford may not have that problem? Or, or is there anything even to make of that Heisman jinx? Well, I think a lot of times there is. But I think it depends on the guy. I think it depends on the, the character and, and just the ability of a guy to kind of focus. Um, I wouldn't really worry about a lot of that with Sam. I think he's a guy that's very well grounded. I think he'll get over this portion and move on and enjoy the Heisman down the road. Let's talk a little bit about Florida because they're the team that stands between Sam Bradford and all the Sooners in a national championship. Dan Mullen, their offensive coordinator, is, has been hired at uh, Mississippi State. Does that do anything to affect the Gators and, and how they're going to head into this national championship game? Well, it can, and I think we're, we're still yet to see what exactly they're going to do with that position. Um, you know, it didn't hurt West Virginia last year. They basically lost their offensive coordinator, Rich Rodriguez, but we've seen it hurt other teams. We've seen it hurt Oklahoma in the past when they've lost Mike Stoops. So mm -hmm. it'll be interesting to see how this plays out and, and, and who really is in charge of the offense. Well, what about the Sooners and their coaching situation? They haven't lost anybody yet, but there's been some rumors of Kevin Wilson maybe being out there, Venables, obviously. Could they lose any of those guys, and how might that impact things? Uh, absolutely. Um, it, that would be a huge situation because we're getting later in the game and the further you get down the road and lose a guy then you're scrambling a little bit. Uh, I would think somebody at some point has got to make a run at uh, Kevin Wilson. I mean look what they've done, look how great this offense was um, and is. Uh, if not this year I think definitely next year he's on the he's on the top of the hot list. Gene Chizik leaves Iowa State to be Auburn's new head coach. Is Iowa State a possibility for Kevin Wilson? Could be. Um, I know he was at least partially in play last time. I would think uh, they, would, they would have to look at a guy like Kevin Wilson. Offense has not been good at Iowa State the last few years. They may want to go in that direction. Uh, it'd be interesting to see. Definitely. Well, John, hey, thanks for pinch hitting for Jake today. Well, we know that the two of you will continue to provide in-depth coverage of the Sooners as they prepare for the national championship game and then when they head to Miami. To follow all the news and analysis, stay with the best coverage team anywhere at NewsOK.com and every day in the Oklahoman.